hey guys welcome back to my channel in today's video we'll look at how we can install software on a debian machine now there's different ways and uh, different tools available for installing software on uh, debian we'll look at some of the tools the main one is uh, apt get tool so let's go ahead and uh, look at some of the examples here now i'm on the terminal i'm going to be running most of the commands on the terminal now it's recommended that we do a package uh, update and also a uh, system upgrade before installing any uh, software. Now to do an update, the command is sudo apt update. And in my case, it's saying three packages can be upgraded. Now you can go ahead and do the upgrade using using sudo apt upgrade. Y for yes. Now, depending on the number of uh, packages that you have that needs to be upgraded, the, pro the process could take a while. So the upgrade is still ongoing. While it's still running, let's open another terminal here. Look at some of the other commands that are available. So when it comes to checking what packages you have installed, some of the commands you can use uh, include apt search can search for instance for nmap and that should tell you if you have nmap uh, installed you can also use which you can also use which nmap and also we can say nmap version that will tell you the version of uh, the software okay so when it comes to uninstalling or removing software on debian Let's look at some of the commands you can run. You can run sudo apt remove, and then the name of the software, let's say, let's say nmap, and that would uh, uninstall nmap. And then you can also run sudo apt purge. This command will remove configuration files. So this is an optional command. Another command you could run is sudo apt auto remove. What this command will do is it will remove an, any unused dependencies. Another useful command is uh, a command you can run if you try to install software and you run into some errors. Sometimes this command can help fix any errors you might run into. So let's look at the command. The command is sudo apt fix broken install so the upgrade is completed here so in case you're running uh, external packages so for instance if you have a file that ends with .deb let me show an example here if we do ls so if you look at this google chrome file it ends with .deb to install such a file the command you'll, you'll use is a sudo dpkg-i and then the package name here. The other tool available is Git. Now this is for source code. If the software you're looking to install is uh, hosted on GitHub or another Git repository, you can use Git using the command git clone. And then here you'll type the repository URL. Once it's uh, th that command is done, you can navigate to the directory and then install the software using sudo make install. Finally, we look at the pip, which is for Python tools. Now, if you don't have pip installed, you can do sudo apt install python python 3 pip. That should install pip. Once you have pip installed and you're looking to install a, a Python package, you can use it using this command pip3 install and then the name of the package. So that's all for this video. Those are some of the tools that we have available for working with the software or packages on Debian. So I hope this information has been helpful. I'll catch you in my next video. Thanks. Bye.